Hello, this is Michael Hartle, author of the Ruby on Rails tutorial, which teaches web development using the Ruby on Rails web framework. Ruby on Rails is used by sites such as Twitter, Hulu, the Yellow Pages, GitHub, and 37signals, creators of the Rails framework. The heart of the Ruby on Rails tutorial is the development of a substantial sample application consisting of a microblogging platform based loosely on Twitter. Users of the sample application can sign out, can sign in, they can view a list of their short posts called microposts, they can edit their information, they can follow and unfollow users, and they can view a feed of the microposts from the users they follow. Let's see what happens if we try to sign up as a new user. Well, it looks like there's a bug in the application. Let's take a look at it. Here we're going to run the tests that are developed as part of the Rails tutorial. And we can see that right now we have uh, three failures. So if we go over here, we can fix that by rendering back the, uh, the page if invalid information is submitted. Let's save that and rerun the test. And there we go. Now it's green. If we refresh this resubmit the information, we get messages telling us which things we need to fill out in the form. The Ruby on Rails tutorial covers everything you need to know to develop industrial strength web applications, including testing, security, source code control, deployment, and of course the Rails framework itself. The Rails tutorial book is available in its entirety as HTML at railstutorial.org book, and it's also available as a PDF, which is easy to read on a computer and is also optimized for e-readers such as iPad and Kindle. Finally, the Rails Tutorial screencasts show you step-by-step -step how to build the Rails Tutorial sample application, including the kind of tips and tricks that are difficult to include in a book. You can buy the Rails Tutorial PDF and screencasts at railstutorial.org.